Okay. Oh, welcome again. We are talking about solving linear simultaneous equation. Now this way this this time we solve it by substitution by substitution method. Okay, by substitution method is as I said before. The substitution method uh, can be explained better by using the game. If we talk about the football game, oh, we can explain better substitution. Now, <clears throat> in football, we say we have first 11 players. First 11 players go into the field to play, to play against the opponent, against the other team. And we have some other players in the at the bench, they are watching the game with their teacher. So those 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 players um, who are watching the game with their teacher, uh, the teacher will uh, try to focus on the players in the pitch who is not playing good. And when he substitutes, so to substitute here, uh, if we talk about if we talk about uh, the football, substitute means to replace so it is uh, I mean to replace to replace so a player is replaced with another player but why do we replace a player it means I think the player I mean teacher want to introduce a new method a new technique which will give him um, goal which will make him to defeat or to defend now against the opponent so when this 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 player goes in he does go with the same technique that the one who is uh, the, like the one who is uh, uh, picked out from the pitch he's going in with a new technique and this is what we are going to do when we do substitution uh, method we do use substitution method in solving simultaneous equation we will introduce a new technique to make sure that we win okay so uh suppose we, we 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 talk about the same questions or we take p we, we can pick different questions um and I, we had this this was our first example x plus y equals to eight and the x minus y equals two i think i still remember this now solve this by substitution method. And solve for x and y using substitution method. So okay, let us see how we move. Okay, if we use substitution, we can choose from any of the three questions, but yet I will, I, will, I will suggest that we choose the simple one now. Here, all of them seem to be simple, except this. the second one is much simple because it is having two and the first one is having eight. So you can say from two, from question number two, which in this case is a simple equation, though you can choose the first one, no problem, you can choose any. So from question number two, we can express x in terms of y, or we can express y in terms of x. So we say here, x minus y equals to two. So if we want to express uh, y in uh, x in terms of y, we say now that x minus y plus y. Now we have added y here. We have added y to this side. We have to add it to the other side. Equals to two plus y. So you see this y positive and this negative will go. So we have x equals to 2 plus y. So this is the new idea I'm talking about. You can call this equation number 3. So x here is called in term of, I mean, x is given a new technique. So we can use this as our, our x. So our opponent knows x, but if we put 2 plus y, oh, we are going to defeat him. So this is a new technique, new technique which expresses x. So we put this in place of x, and we don't 
we don't put it in the same equation where we, we, we made our technique. No, we put it in the first equation. So we say put uh, x equal to 2 plus y into equation number 1. So we made it from 2 and we put it to 1. You cannot make it from 2 and then put it to 2 again, you know. If you made it from 2, then we put it, we said from 2. So we cannot put it again into 2, we put it into 1. So this equation will go here. So, okay. So we put this into 1. We have x plus y equal to 8, but the value of x equal to this. So x plus y equal to 8, but we know what is x equal to 2 plus y. So we have, as our new question here, that in, uh, y, I mean 2 plus y, this is for x, this is stands for x, then plus another y equal to 8. This is the y which is here. So if we open the bracket, we have 2 plus y. Uh, I mind you, this x now should be removed from there to avoid confusion. Um, so 2 plus y um, plus another y equals to 8. So 2 plus 2y equals to 8. Now we remain with i, y, we uh, subtract 2 both sides. So 2 minus 2 plus 2y equals to 8 minus 2. Whatever you do to the right, to the left hand side, you do to the right hand side. So 2 minus 2 is 0. We have 2y equal to 6 divided by 2, divided by 2, and you have that you are y equal to 3. So we have our y equal to equal to 3. So if this is the value of y we have, okay, I can draw a line here. We can find the value of x sharp. So we use this. So we know that x equal to 2 plus y, but y equal to what? To 3. So plus 3 and the so plus 3, we all know this is equal to 5. So therefore, x equal to 5 and y equal to 3. So if you put 5 here and then you get 8, if this is 5 and this is 3, 5 plus 3 is 8 for sure. And if uh, this is 5 and this is 3, this will be equal to 2. So you see how substitution um, works better. So that is substitution. If this is a substitution method and the, again I advise you to go through once more again if you don't understand go through go through make sure you understand okay make sure you understand everything here and if you don't please go once again and if you don't then you'll have to contact me as usual. This is my contact. Or this. Feel free to contact me anytime and I'll make sure that I give my, my help on that. Be